A convoy of truckers will make its way to the southern border to draw attention to the worsening migrant crisis. All of this coming weeks after more than 300,000 migrants crossed into the U.S. in December. That is a record-setting month for encounters along the U.S.-Mexico border. Tom Dempsey is in Norfolk, Virginia this morning, which is where the convoy will be leaving from. Uh, Tom, you set the, the stage and the scene for us this morning. Who is this group? Yeah, well, they're, they're, it's describing this event, and the organizers are describing it as the Take Our Border Back Convoy, and they expect hundreds of people to be part of this. It's all starting here at this parking lot here in Norfolk, Virginia, in just about two hours. And like I said, they expect hundreds of people to be part of this as they get sent to travel across the country, all to put the focus on the ongoing border crisis. So after meeting up here in Virginia later this morning, this group plans to make multiple stops uh, heading to Jacksonville, Florida, then Louisiana, then to some of the uh, hot spots uh, regarding uh, migrant crossings, including Eagle Pass, Texas, Yuma, Arizona, and San Ysidro, California, where they plan to hold rallies this upcoming Saturday. This all comes ahead of a big week dealing with the border crisis issue. Uh, tomorrow, House Republicans plan to mark up two articles of impeachment against Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas. They accuse Mayorkas of failing to manage the border and say he is guilty of high crime and misdemeanors. The articles of impeachment describe Mayorkas as failing to enforce U.S. immigration policies at the border and disregarding laws passed by Congress as well as breaching public trust. House Speaker Mike Johnson has vowed to hold a vote as soon as possible, but it's, you know, we will note even if the House ends up impeaching Mayorkas, it remains very unlikely that the Senate, controlled by Democrats, would convict him in a trial. And just a little bit of history here uh, with this impeachment vote coming up uh, possibly soon soon, uh, Mayorkas could become the first presidential cabinet member in almost 150 years to be impeached. But like you said, Marky, you know, the timing of this um, convoy happening later this morning, it comes after the last fiscal year set a record for encounters along the southern border. Uh, U.S. Customs and Border Protection data show that December sent them set a monthly record for encounters along the border with over 300 thousand encounters recorded again uh, these organizers expect to kick things off in just about two hours from this parking lot here in virginia marky thanks for watching everybody go to joinnn.com to find news nation on your television provider also don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of news nation's fact-driven unbiased coverage